As the sun breaks above the Duwamish River, Muckleshoot tribal members return from a long night's work. It's the start of another season in the long history of tribal fishing on the Salish Sea. Always exciting to uh, see everybody come out for the first fishery and lots of families, uh, many generations in one boat at times, um, passing that skill along to the younger fishers. And uh, it's just an exciting day for us here on the water. Today, tribal members will sell their catch to create income while enriching their culture. The salmon will now be processed and sold to grocery stores and food suppliers across the United States. And thanks to a partnership with Food Lifeline, this salmon will also make its way into food banks across western Washington. We're buying directly from the tribe who is going out and catching all of these fish. So instead of dealing with a lot of vendors who are basically middlemen, we are going directly to the source and able to provide that pricing to all of our agencies. Food Lifeline is investing in organizations that are creating a sustainable future through land and water stewardship, cultural preservation, and the sharing of food waste. Food Lifeline is committed to not only providing food, but to creating strategic partnerships. Partnerships that allow us to promote food justice, the belief that everyone should have access to healthy, nutritious, and culturally relevant food. This also includes working to remove cultural and structural barriers to food access. Barriers that include poverty, environmental injustice, racial inequity, and more. In Kent, Washington, Food Lifeline trucks deliver food to the Relief Hunger Organization. This is one of 16 mobile food programs that Food Lifeline supports each and every month. Miriam Mawalo and her community partners escaped 14 years of civil war in Liberia. Today, they help other refugees coming here from all over the globe. Last year, they distributed more than 40,000 pounds of food, all supplied by Food Lifeline. When it comes to our community, there are varieties of people, like people from all country, so different, different nationalities, so we just help everybody. We don't do pick and choose. These mobile food programs help us deliver to areas lacking grocery stores and public transportation. Places where it's harder for people to get the food they need. But this is just one of the many ways Food Lifeline is working with its nearly 300 partners across Western Washington. At North Seattle College, it's providing produce and proteins for students. In Skagit County, it's stocking mobile food trucks to reach rural families. In Whatcom County, it's helping plant edible landscaping at affordable housing communities as a unique way to help neighbors eat well. These are just a few of the ways we are focused on investments that will make immediate impacts while sparking generational change. Our community is powerful. With your help, we can source and distribute nutritious food while addressing the root causes of hunger. When everyone brings their unique skills, knowledge, and resources to the table, our individual ripples come together to make unstoppable waves of change. Be a part of that wave and make an investment to solve hunger. Together we'll make sure everyone eats well while building a future where food is a right for all.